Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Destiny. I am Death from Above. I wanted to throw another live comm at you. We're going to do some skirmish because that was the daily, but we're going to talk about the PDX 45, specifically full auto and why I like it on a high rate of fire pulse rifle. Now, take a look at my loadout. I'm running Striker Titan again because I like it. I have my God Roll PDX 45 with perfect balance, SPO 28 sight, full auto, and rifled barrel. You don't need to worry about any of the rest of the options because that is what it's got. And there you go right there. You see exactly why I like it. The guy was already shooting me. I turned to face, shot him, and won the exchange. So all I do with this is I treat it like an auto rifle where I pull the trigger and just aim. Aim for the head. And it's very easy with rifle barrel to get headshots, even from distance with this gun. <clears throat> and I really like it. So we're going to throw throw some live comm, throw some ideas at you. I want to get my grasp of Malik over here so we can talk about it too. And why... Ow, 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 ow. No, don't shoot me. We're doing a, we're doing a video here, fellas. Live videoing from death from above. All right. Let's see if we can kill that Titan again. Got him. So... Like I said, this full auto PDX 45 is a low rate of fire, or a low impact, high rate of fire pulse rifle. It's not as low as the Grasp of Malik's. That's the only one that's a higher rate of fire, lower impact than this one. But they're in the same area, that low rate of fire, high, the low impact, high rate of fire archetype. And what I found with these guns is when I'm using them personally, I can't pull the trigger at the right tempo. I don't have the right tempo for the trigger and getting the shots to land consistently while pulling the trigger and it's just the, you know I'm a musician I like to play guitar and getting the right tempo on a gun is very important for me ah got punched getting the right tempo on a gun is important for me <clears throat> because it helps me get to the feel of the gun and enjoy it and if I can't get there it kinda throws me off during the gameplay so <clears throat> it's kind of an interesting situation where it's something that doesn't matter, but it's something when it comes to top-level gameplay or when I'm trying to be really competitive, it's important to me. So I've got to know these things, and I've got to, got to have a good feel for the weapon if I'm going to use it in certain situations. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Almost got him. <clears throat> so trigger tempo, <laughs> if that even is a thing, is important to me. I like having the right trigger tempo. I like being able to feel the gun out and enjoy it. And kind of know what's going on. Full auto on a and on well on these high rate of fire auto ri uh, pulse rifles. Auto rifles. It's not an auto rifle. I have trouble with that. And obviously. There you see. You know, that's one of the problems, though. I can waste. Where did he go? Where did he go? This guy flittering around over here, man. <clears throat> I will take some help from some teammates. Boom. boom. So. It's hard to uh, it's hard for me to get that trigger tempo, and it's very important for me to get that trigger tempo, and I really like having that trigger tempo. That guy's not paying attention. So <clears throat> having that full auto turns this into basically an auto rifle with a three burst, three burst auto rifle. I will have that punch, and it makes it feel better. So like I said, when I'm being top tier competitive, which is not very often, uh, I will use this one. But say if I go into the Iron Banner doing the sixes. And I want to be competitive. I want to get those wins to get those medallions uh, unlocked. I'll use something like this. Something that I'm very comfortable with. Something that's very user friendly. Something that is top tier. And this gun with rifle barrel pushes that range out. With full auto makes it so much fun. So that's honestly one reason you haven't seen me use the grasp of Malik too much. So we're going to put the grasp on. This is an unleveled grasp that I've had. And we're gonna, I'm going to show you why I have such a hard time with this one. And it's because I have to get used to the trigger tempo, and I'm just not used to it. So, oh, that guy was not even looking at me. So, trigger tempo <coughs> is actually really important to me. It, this is a word I just made up right here, live on the video. So, um, I can't, I don't like pulling the trigger so fast. It's kind of like a, uh, a really high rate of fire scout rifle, where you're pulling the trigger so fast, you kind of... If you hear me, you can probably hear my controller clicking away when I'm pulling the trigger on the grasp. But if this thing had full auto and some good stability, it would be god tier. It would be what I consider god tier. Um, so it's one of those things where it's personal preference. Ooh, he got me. <clears throat> and then he got taken out. It's personal preference. But for me, I like full auto on these guns. And I want to ask you guys a question mid-game. <clears throat> what do you like on your high rate of fire pulse rifles? What is your god roll? 
what do you enjoy uh, what talents do you like? What did you get on your grasp of Malik? I know a lot of you guys probably got a grasp of Malik. What did you get on it? What do you like having on it while we pick up the heavy and go to town on the other team? You did not escape me, sir. This is the intermission, guys, where we just talk <clears throat> and have fun shooting things. Oh, there's heavy over here, too, huh? What? I hit him full on with a rocket. Oh, I'm out. <laughs> I am out. That was crazy. Guys, you got to witness that on stream. You saw me hit that guy. Get off me. That's why you hold on to your slam. I will take some overshield. Please, 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 please. There we go. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a live con with death from above. So, there you see right there, trigger tempo was a little off. I didn't quite hit them as fast as it could fire. But maybe that's a good thing with this gun because sometimes you have a tendency to fire it off too fast, waste your mag. And, uh, go a little beyond the the magazine oh am i gonna get him am i gonna get him i got him because he was trying to shotgun me the guy behind me got me so <clears throat> full auto on a high rate of fire pulse rifle i believe for me is necessary it may not be necessary for you this is not a one size fits all this is a why i think you need it or why i think i like it so we're gonna go back to the pdx 45 just enjoy the killtages and talk about pulse rifles in general. Now, pulse rifles, I think, in year two have been my favorite archetype of weapon. They are kind of user-friendly. They fit the mold of a couple different things, and I like using them. They, they do a couple things for me that an auto rifle can't quite do, and they do it better than a scout rifle for me. So, auto rifle with full auto has been my my go-to gun. Now I don't know if in Rise of Iron they're gonna change anything here because usually when year when a new year a new big expansion pops up they do modify some things so I don't know if year three they're gonna change some archetypes up do some balancing they usually do so I can definitely see that happening oh I'm gonna get him I'm gonna get him nope didn't get him teammate did though so <laughs> Top score in a live com, guys. Welcome to the stream. I do this live on stream too, so if you're ever hanging out on my YouTube channel in the morning or on a Sunday night and you like, eh, this is a cool video, I like it, and you want to know what's going on with me, you can usually check out my Twitch channel. I might be online. You never know. I usually get on every day at some point. They're not very long streams, but let's get a filter test weapon in there. Ouch. <clears throat> Lightning grenade. That's my job. And so. That's what I usually do, sometimes in the morning, sometimes in the evenings. Going to Destiny Con, and uh, I'm excited about that. So the full auto PDX-45 uh, ramble mode in the end right now. I love this gun. It's going to be one of my, my top year two guns. Just look at that range right there, taking him out with the headshots. That was just me getting the aim on target and holding the trigger. <clears throat> that's why I like, once again, that's why I like these full auto high rate of fire pulse rifles. They just have they have that sweet spot for me. They may not for you, they do for me. Oh, that guy Nova bombed me and I slammed him. So, <clears throat> what do you guys think again? What's your favorite pulse rifle right now? What talents do you have on it? Uh, what do you like or not like about this? Do you think full auto is necessary? Do you think full auto is a waste of a perk? What do you think? So, boom, <laughs> let's get the slam. There we go. Got the double down. They thought I was gone. So, it's another example of how to how to use a gun to your advantage, and then how to use a character to your advantage. So, I think I think as far as this goes, oh, came up short. <laughs> uh, full auto PX45. That's what the video title's about. That may not be what the video's about, but I do think full auto is very fun. It's one of oh let's let's exchange okay let's exchange with this guy he's got a scout rifle we're at range you can see I'm still getting 24 got the kill headshots at normal range is 25 headshots at long range are 24 <clears throat> tag him tag him again tag him again go for the win no let's see if we can get a shoulder charge for the win mm, I'm feeling he's over here somewhere nope oh. We can't finish them off. We can't finish them off. Oh, guys. Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay. We won. Top score. 
wrapping it up, PDX-45 Full Auto. It was a gun that flew under the radar this week at the Gunsmith because the Army NSD was there, and the Army NSD is so top tier in the meta. But I think this is a more effective gun if you can get the right roll on it. I held it on my package. You probably should too, unless you really want one right now. But top tier gun. Let me know what you think in the comments. 19 and 13 live com performance with a legendary Ingram. Holy crap, legendary Ingram. So, guys, thanks so much for watching. Leave a like if you've enjoyed this. Subscribe if you want to see more. Share the video. It helps to grow. It helps the channel grow. I really appreciate all you guys. Until next time, I'm Death Rub. I will see you later. See you bye.